Welcome to today's video everybody. We are back at Ebisu Circuit, but today we're going to be doing some seat time practice with my boy Rohab. Hey guys. He's uh, recently done some more power mods to his S15 and even wrapped his car. Our nation is his company name. He's making some adjustments to his suspension. He just drove an JIDC. But yeah, we'll have to get him to explain this later, but I think that's meant to be Rohab. <laughs> All right, let's go Rohabi. now. He even got anti lag on this thing. So shortly after I just filmed those clips with Rohab, Moni's car had a little bit of a problem. Oh, this hill sucks. Come on. Ah, gonna need that onsen tonight. <laughs> the power steering um, uh, bolts that go into the pump with the uh, crush washers, they all came loose. So this thing just started pouring out power steering fluid everywhere. We had to push a car off the track, get Ebisu out here to clean it all up. All that kind of stuff. The fun stuff that happens only when the camera's off. But we fixed her car now, so she'll be good. But I'm gonna go out and do a couple laps in my car, warm it up, and then me and Rohab will work on some tandems. We also did a, uh, a bonnet delete mod on uh, Rohab's car. He was getting some high temps, and we did the good old Ebisu Matsuri trick where you just tilt the pod filter up in the air and take the hood off, and now she's running icy cold, well, right? Yeah, perfectly fine. Also no rear bumper, so and he doesn't yeah. hold up in there. Yeah, so last time we saw this, it didn't have a rear mount radiator, but now he's got like a rear mount radiator set up. And he's having problems where like if he doesn't have the bumper, if he has the bumper there, it like traps a lot of air and it doesn't this like flow nice. Track, so it's yeah. gonna be doing that. Yeah, north course you wouldn't have a problem with that. Yeah, but I'm excited to go up there. School doesn't have much air movement because you're just so short and yeah. barely moving. Anyways, we'll do some warm ups, warm up the diff transmission, all that stuff, and then we'll get into some driving. You had one job and you let me down.
we're now at North Course, and for the longest time, I've been wanting to test the Z in the dry here. And just every time I've been here in the Z, the weather's been terrible. But now, the weather's great. We've got some two two fives in the back, and I want to see if we can throw some backies with the Z at North Course.
some of the sketchiest driving I think we've done at North Course. Take out, like not even wet driving is that sketchy here. Those tires, man, nah. Oh yeah. I don't even know how we got one or two laps in. I thought you were going straight for that hill Me one, too. one time. That last section on the Mungie, I was like, yeah, I'll just try and do another one. Like, you know. Nope. <laughs> the car was like, nope, take me in. No grip at oh, that all. Was fun. That was it was really fun, fun, but for sure. Yeah. Oh. Definitely. We got to do these practice days more often, just yeah. with more tires. I know. Let's do it. Let's do it. It's breakfast time, guys. You guys are gonna love the car that we got here in Okinawa. It's a Toyota. Are you ready for this? It's a Prius! Yeah, let's go! Gonna do so many front wheel drive skids. We got the McDonald's trays for the back. We're gonna be drifting this thing all throughout Okinawa. I love the, the wings on the, the... Oh yeah, yeah, the Prius wing. Ugh, dude, I'm just loving short weather right now. Look at these pasty white boy thighs. Let's go, baby. How do you fit in here? How do I fit in here? You know, that is a question that I ask myself as well. I don't know. It's so weird how you just like push a button and then the car's like moving. Let's go, guys. Prius things. Also, this Priuses are the best because you have this video game here, this free video game, and, and your goal is to fill this battery up while you're driving. Only, only Prius drivers get a free video game while they play, get, uh, while they drive. <sighs> We're on vacation, everybody. We went to Okinawa, Japan's ghetto Hawaii. And uh, we're just enjoying the beach and taking a week off. So uh, I don't know if there's gonna be any content after this video for a couple days. There probably will be because that's just how we roll, but yeah. We'll see. Expect um, beach summer arc filler episode. Next, next, next video. Yeah, but splash water, I think. Splash water, yeah. <laughs> I'll be wearing a bikini. Yeah, we get to go bikini shop now. <laughs> oh God. Anyway, so welcome to Okinawa, everybody. We're just on the beach, going for a nice walk. Um, I think after this, we have dinner with some friends and stuff like that, but mainly Okinawa is just such a go-to place, guys, especially if you want to like go on vacation and all that kind of stuff. It really is like Japan's own version of Hawaii. Checking out some of these little rock pools here. And it might be hard to see, but there's a little blue fish there. Might be really hard to see, but there's some Really cool little like fishes and oh he's going on oh there he is look how blue that is what is that There's a lot of cool little things all trapped in this little rock pool here that all get you know stuck in here when the tide goes out and stuff man there's like little blue fish and stuff like bright blue fish stuck here over there too oh wow look there's some more of the blue fishes down here too. I wonder what they are. I don't think they're dories. Oh wow, look, they're all in here too. The simple stuff, you know what I mean? Vacation. There's also a very large sea cucumber right there. That's kind of cool. I mean, it, it looks pretty big, pretty well endowed. No, not that big. That's like monsterish size. Dude, the water looks beautiful and you see like all the blue skies rolling back in now that the clouds are moving out of the way from that storm out there. Now, I'm not sure if this is it, but we were reading a sign that on this beach there were ruins of some temple or something. And I'm not sure if these are the ruins or if it's somewhere else in the sand, but... Very cool. Huh, the big long black things? No, 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 no. They're hidden. Like, see, see there? Yeah, it's like brown and then it has... It has the dots on it? Yeah. Yeah, that's them. Not these big brown ones under here. That's different. Oh, see that big one there? Yo, this one's like 10 inches long. Oh, wow. Yeah. That Look at this big. sea cucumber. This Did guy's big. Yeah, I'm not taking it out because that kills them, right? Well, they don't really kill themselves. They just escape. 
Oh my god, he's moving. He's shrinking up. Oh, it feels so weird. It's like leather. Oh. Nice little guy, right? Oh. Yes. Whoa. <laughs> Look at this little guy. And you can tell if they're male or female by this section here. So see how it's a really sharp point? Yeah. So that means that's a male. If it was like a curved point on the bottom there, that'd be a female. Oh, the fishes work like that too. He's pretending to be dead. But look. He's good. Let him go. Nice little sand crab. All right, now if we be very, very quiet and don't move, there's a little hermit crab in that little shell there. Oh, he's coming out. He's coming out, guys. Yep. There he goes. Yo, look at this guy go. Man, he's drag racing with that two bottle pack of NOS in the back. V8. Running meth. So you enjoying vacation, May? Yeah, I am. It's good, right? It's good. We uh, we really wanted to spend some time together just relaxing and everything because stuff is about to get really intense, obviously with the new shop and everything going on there okay. and FD as well. There's an FD round happening next week and just there's so much coming up and a lot of crazy content and whatnot and this is probably the only chance we're going to get to take some time off for quite a while at least until maybe the end of the year so good little kind of vacay in the middle of the year well a little bit after the middle of the year but anyways the weather's been really really good since we've been here there's a little bit of bad weather kind of like rolling in over on the ocean out there might be hard to see but you can see here that's actually rain like hitting the ocean out there. It's kind of cool to see like all the rain falling from the clouds. But this is it. There's only been a little bit of rain today and it's still kind of really nice out. The sun coming through the clouds and the water's still perfect. Yesterday was really hot and brutal. Yeah, yeah, it hurt. It really hurt. Yeah, it burned. But yeah, no, we're just really like living our best life right now. Having a good break, a much needed break. You look like Oh, I'm 100% in vacation mode. By the way, shout out to all you guys that follow me on Twitter because you guys help make decisions on what uh, Hawaiian shirts to go with. We got a bright orange one as well. I ended up buying two. But yeah, we've, this is my vacay outfit and I think I'm killing it. I'm killing it right now. Love and life. Also, these glasses match my hair, so massive hype. I think we're going to go head back to American Village where our hotel is. And uh, seems like a wedding couple is here getting photography done right now. So congratulations to them. Oh my God, there's freaking goats there. Is that an Okinawan thing? Yeah. Everyone has goats? People eat goats. People eat them? Yeah. No, that's not cool. <laughs> Guys, I think, I think I found my new favorite shirts, all right? Like I've never worn Hawaiian shirts in my life, but I just bought my third one today and I tell you what, I am a changed man. These are freaking lit, all right? I don't know if I wouldn't wear them, if I would wear them any other, dude, we should just watch up, uh, blah. We should just rock up to FD wearing this. <laughs> okay. I think it'd be great. Anyways, we got, an orange one, we got the other one you saw me wearing today, and I just bought this one. And um, I have to say, I like the nice little pink uh, pink guys in here. Hibis uh, Hibiscus. I don't know what they're called. I don't know, but my whole outfit is just perfect. Like we got the pink bangs in the hair, the pink sunnies, you know, and then now a little bit of pink in the Hawaiian shirt. I think we have one. This is definitely the best vacation get up in my opinion. Anyways, guys. 
Thanks for watching. I'm sure this video was a bit confusing with some drifting and shredding and GoPro footage going missing. So that didn't end up becoming one whole video. And now we're here at vacation. So enjoy guys, smash that like button, write a comment and subscribe. And don't forget to just sometimes take some time off with you and your loved one or loved things, whatever you're into. I love you guys. Like, comment, share, subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Peace, Jamata. You had one job and you let me down. Bye, have a beautiful time.